Fuel capsules 1 and 3 have been disconnected from the reactor monitoring system due to an unknown error. Attempting troubleshoot. Troubleshoot failure. System unresponsive. A full restart of the reactor monitoring system may be required to reconnect. Attention! Reactor temperatures approaching unsustainable levels. Preparing to reconfigure core systems for reignition. Reactor temperature descending beyond 325 Kelvin. Preparing to set new stall temperature set point. Warning, reactor chamber temperatures approaching sub-zero values. Data suggests that irregular reactor behavior is occurring. Attempting to perform diagnostic scan of reactor vessel. Combustion failure detected. Temperatures within the superstructure and containment chamber are continuing to decrease. Uh, hey reactor ops. Last time I checked, the reactor's temperature is incapable of reaching the values it's achieving while well, the thing is in operation. The fact it's able to maintain the reaction is a whole other matter, but please, find a way to stop whatever is going on inside the vessel. Danger. Diagnostic scan results suggest that a chemical change is occurring within the fuel injection feed. Attempting to initiate chemical change intervention by Z1012 injection. Stand by for power laser reignition. Critical error. Power laser combustion ignition failure. Chamber temperatures are too low for combustion to start. Chemical change continues to progress. Attention. Reactor temperature stabilized at 32 Kelvin. Temperature is too low for nominal operations. Attempting complete fuel injection cutoff and in attempt to raise reactor temperature. Attention, 
Crystallization detected with a nickel and feed. Attention. Power is or fuel temperature dropping. Chance of successful reignition compromised. Warning. Primary grid output critical. Complete grid failure imminent. Suggest formation of Zenton 15. Power laser reignition is now full time. Please evacuate to the flash shelter and prepare for a facility wide blackout. Warning Detecting deterioration of the energy capsule superstructure. Data suggests that a Zentum 15 breach may occur. Please evacuate to the blast shelter immediately. Danger. Breach of reactor fuel counts is detected. Zentum 15 volume increasing rapidly due to low temperature conditions. Absolute zero. Detected chamber degradation. Warning. Primary grid failure detected. Facility thermal regulation system offline. Emergency reserve active. Warning, emergency reserve capacitors cannot operate normally in low temperature conditions. Failure of the reserve likely to occur in three minutes. Alert, facility temperature dropping rapidly. Blast shelter thermal regulation systems activated. Facility blast shelter will seal in T minus 60 seconds. Superstructure failure detected. Zentin 15 thermal transfer detected. Sector C temperatures dropping rapidly. Warning. Sector C connection lost. Unable to monitor Zentin 15 activity. Attention. Low temperature conditions detected in central mainframe. System failures may occur. Warning. Multiple facility system failures detected. Facility link node, offline. Calamity management systems, offline. Velocity mainframe now operating on low power mode. Detecting thermal transferring throughout bottom side complex. Disconnecting all metallic connections to the blast shelter. Access track returning to sector A. Facility temperature has reached negative 40 degrees Celsius. Prepare to seal blast shelter. Warning. Facility structural stability dropping rapidly. Estimated time until facility collapse is one minute. 
glass shelter ceilings have been initiated. They're hurting the remaining facility power to glass control systems to ensure survival of the shelter.